Yesterday, we told you about the Syracuse Development Academy and how it's taking youth soccer to the next level. It is similar to that of AAU basketball. Some of the best local high school players teaming up together and wreaking havoc on the rest of the nation. There's been a lot of bumps along the way. We've uh, lost a few games that we shouldn't have, but um, I think in regionals, we especially like started working as a team and I don't know, it's just been great. Great way to end off the whole, my whole career as a club soccer player. A trip to the national championships is certainly a great way to end the season. However, the Syracuse Development Academy has grown accustomed to high-level success. SDA is one of three other club soccer teams to send three or more age groups to the championships in Frisco, Texas next week. That includes the U18 girls, the U16 girls, and the U13 boys. It says a lot about our club. We put in a lot of work to get here. And uh, we always come to practice prepared to get the job done. And, I mean, we lost in State Cup, but we came back strong. It's like, it's big. It's a big, big event, and it's great for the club, and it's good for, for us to go see many different teams and play against other, other states. Now, SDA just sent the U18 girls to Texas last year, but to have three teams representing Syracuse, which represents the entire western New York region, says quite a bit about where the sport currently is and where it is heading into the future. You know, especially having uh, some really good local colleges here, um, you know, we're we're able to send kids to, to local programs here that are already good. And, you know, obviously having greater success nationally, we can send them nationally. The U18 girls roster, for instance, is filled with players who have already signed to play college soccer in the fall. The sport has never been better in this area, and a national championship could turn Central New York into the next hotbed for prep soccer throughout the country. It would be remarkable. Um, you know, like I said, we're going into it like we're going to go win. So, um, you know, I hope we come back in a few weeks and we have another trophies for you and another interview. So. <laughs>